All right, what is going on, guys? It is Alex. Yo, can, can you guys chill for a sec? Never. I'm trying to do an intro. Let's go! Fuck yeah! I'm out. It's not fun, guys. It's not it fun. fun. It's not, it's fun, not if you're, fun if you're shit. I keep losing, but it's not fun. Get better. <laughs> Hi, what is going on everyone? It is Alex or FaceApp here today back again with another video today with another video I got the new camera set up this diesel ass lens I used it for my video yesterday for the first time and I think I like it. it's nice It's crispy it looks good anyway today What I was gonna do was I was gonna react to rich kid snapchats because you guys know I've made a few of those videos and they always come out really good But I was like, you know what? I've made like three of those I think you guys have seen enough rich kid snapchats Maybe maybe we should switch it up a little bit and react to kids test answers like kids who are in grade school even younger Just finessing the fuck out of their teachers. I love this shit because I can really relate to these kids who are sitting in school, they're taking these bullshit tests, and they don't want to do it, alright, so they just, you know, little, little shortcut, you know, I'm gonna show you guys what I mean, here we go. So example one, what ended, say, say you're in school, you're taking a test, what ended in 1896, probably some revolutionary war, or like, some document was signed, some bullshit, I don't know, dude, don't ask me. What I do know, though, is that 1895 ended in 1896, and that's what this kid put as an answer, and honestly, if the teacher marked him off for that, that's just not cool, because that, is that incorrect? Is that false answer? You gotta be more specific with the question, lady. The next one's a math problem. Math, especially pre-calculus, dude. I struggled with that so much in high school. I don't know what kind of math this is. This isn't, you know, that level, but still. Name the quadrilateral. And this dude literally gave them names. Like, there's a box up here. You're supposed to, you know, if it's a rectangle, you put rectangle. If it's a rhombus, whatever that is, you put rhombus. This dude just gave them names. Bob, Sam, Kate, Harry. Fuck yeah. All right, so this is some science. All right, so we're going around history, math, science. What is the strongest force on Earth? Love, baby, love. This kid put love and the teacher put a fucking X through it. Come on. Alright? Come on, dude. That's what these kids know, dude. That's probably what their parents told them. Nothing is stronger than love, okay? It's the most powerful thing out there, okay? It's crazy. And he got marked off for it. Not cool at all, alright? So Peter, he's taking a math test and he's got to expand this equation. And he just wrote it further apart each time. Fuck, that's genius, dude. That's fucking genius. What's an example of a risk? This. Oh, and he got the point for that. That's awesome. Briefly explain what hard water is. I ex pure genius, okay? That was the shortest way to briefly explain it. Because it's what it is. What did you expect? Hard water is what happens when the solution of water gets dissolved into... No, it's not dissolved. It's... Uh, the particles, they come together. What do we call the science of classifying living things? Racism. Straight up. I don't know what answer they were expecting here. If, like, if this was like something they were studying and like he was supposed to know what the correct term for it was but that is pretty spot on so this next one is like some preschool shit dude this is 2006 this is test is 11 years old anyway i just thought that was cool cow bird cat dog like little fill in the blank fish and then fuck he just put fuck dude a preschooler <laughs> that's aggressive that's very aggressive but i like i mean it's clearly a duck but he's just, just a savage <laughs> where was the american declaration of independence signed at the bottom boom bitch oh 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 it's like a clap back dude i'm loving these because dude they're right because they're true they're actually true i mean it was probably signed yo what's good oh bet what's that oh oh alert Thanks, Chell. It's probably signed, I think it was signed probably in Washington. Oh God, I'm gonna get roasted for this. Somewhere on the East Coast, I feel like one of the colonies. It had to have been over there somewhere. Listen, bottom line, it was signed at the bottom. So it says, cause, Tony practices the piano 20 minutes every day. Effect, he's a big nerd. Dude, what a mean kid, okay? It's only 20 minutes, God damn it. That doesn't make him a nerd. Maybe he's gonna grow up and be making beats or something and like producing, doing like some EDM shit, I don't know. Just 20 minutes, dude. He's not a nerd. Tony practices piano six hours every day. He's a fucking nerd. He's a dork, actually. But dude, come on, that was me. Unscramble the words to make a sentence about each sentence. So it's a goat, and it says, is pen and a goat my A? And I guess you're supposed to pick apart the words and make a sentence. This is absolutely the most fucked up one I've seen all video. Like, he put my penis in a goat. Can't be doing that shit. No, fucking goats and shit. Don't put your penis in a goat, little Timmy. God. Miranda can't see anything when she looks down her microscope. Suggest one reason why. She's blind. <laughs> She's, she is blind. Miranda can't see shit. Absolutely nothing. Nothing going on up here. Of course, though, he got marked off. It was a nice try. The teacher, at least the teacher acknowledged. 
Draw a picture of what you will look like in a hundred years. In a hundred years, I will be blank years old. This kid Warren just wrote his grave and put rip. There's no way you're making it to a hundred, to be honest, Warren. A lot of us out here probably aren't making it past 70, 80. I don't know. No way. Dude, it's going to take some effort to get to hundred. I'm trying to be out of here by 40, fucking 35 the earliest. Warren gets it. He knows he's not going to make it to hundred. This is a correct answer. If he got marked off for, for that one, I might have to, I'm gonna have to get in contact with that teacher because that's not cool. Oh, this one's gay. Okay, so you know how like you get those papers that you have to bring home to your parents and they'd have to sign and check off for bad behavior when you got your grades back or, or just random things like for tests, I don't know. And all the teachers are like, you cannot forge this. It's illegal, you'll go to jail. I never forged a signature in school at all because I was scared that I was gonna go to jail. I had the fear of God put in me by my fucking first grade teacher that if I ever tried some shit like that, and so this kid got one of those papers and he just straight up wrote mom on it like in print not even cursive or anything Not even his mom's name, which is what you're supposed to do He just wrote mom in like kid writing and now he's in jail. What a fucking stupid kid What is the best estimate for the length of a football one football? One foot and then you just put ball. Well, I mean that probably would have been right anyway It's not like a football is over four fucking feet uh, there's, right, that's like fucking. Just picture apex of size. All right, that's the length of the football. That's his second closest off. Come on, dude, you need to do that. In a word, describe school. Hell. <laughs> <coughs> what the fuck? I'm okay. I'm okay. We're just gonna move on. Directions. Read each of the problems and come up with a solution for each one. Your problem: you fell on the playground, scratch your knee. The solution: maybe get a band aid. Maybe see the nurse. Maybe tell a teacher. Nah, no. Nah, fuck all that noise. Get up and deal with it. You bitch ass, suck it up, dude. Don't be crying and shit. You can't lie, that one, that, that one's pretty savage. I'll give it to him. What is your favorite hue? What the fuck is a hue, first of all? I see shit about shapes up there. I have no idea. I have hue lights in my room. The blue one is probably the dopest looking one. This kid just put Hugh Jackman, fucking Wolverine. I know, this is Spider-Man because the new Spider-Man moves out and it's lit, so like, what do you like most about your teacher? What do you like most about your teacher? Boobs. <laughs> oh, that's great. All right, so listen, before I reveal the answer, I want everyone to think about this. Leave in the comments for this one, all right? What do you think the best solution to overpopulation is? Pour your argument with examples. So like maybe, maybe send some fucking people to Mars or like civilize some of all the fucking desert in Arizona. There's so much where people could live there, put up a fucking house or something. Make more, make more bunk beds. Or you could just skirt around the logical options. Those are logical, right? I think those are logical. And we can all compete in the Hunger Games, baby. Snap each other's necks and shit. Cause that's what this kid put. And honestly, dude, I'd be down to be in the Hunger Games, not to lose. Not like a real Hunger Games. Like you die and like you don't really die, like medics come and save you and you're just out of the fucking game or something. You know, that, then that wouldn't solve overpopulation. Okay, so fuck it. We're just gonna do the real Hunger Game. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, this is, this is actually hilarious. So, this is a spelling test. This kid missed everyone, missed every word. The only word he spelled right was illiterate. That's awesome. But honestly, you guys, I think that is gonna do it for today's video. Those were actually really funny. I hope you guys all enjoyed. And let me know what you think of these type of videos. If you guys wanna see me make more of them or less of them, if you fucking hate them and you never wanna see them again, let me know. Anyways, guys, this has been your boy Alex or Face Zap. Today's post notification shout out goes to. If you want to post a notification, all you got to do is like the video, leave a comment at what time you saw Waldo, and turn on and hit the little bell next to my name, turn on post notifications. This has been your boy, Alex Fazab. Sadud, Fazadud, listen me.